man. Oh, man. Wagwan, peoples. Wagwan. I'm Dingo Star, a.k.a. Freshly Snipes, a.k.a. Cassius Medias. And I'm back for another one, y'all. Yeah. Usually those ones that are difficult to start off. Usually when things get flowing. But I don't know how to start this one. But I'm going to get right into it like I always do. All right. Um, DJ Khaled, right? DJ Khaled has been outed as being gay. Peace and Ross, which say good boys, okay? Mm-hmm. They, they, they're gay. Who? Both. Eddie and Ross and Khaled. They're all gay. Okay? DJ Khaled, Rick, Ross, yeah. and Diddy? Yeah. They're all gay? Yeah. Gotcha. Right. Khaled is a... How do I know this? Yeah, He's been what, outed how do you know this? by... I don't want to say his name. I can say his name. Jonathan Odie. Yeah. Jonathan Odie was P. Diddy's sex slave. That's his definition, not mine. Um, Jonathan Odie confesses to being at the Diddy party, says that he's at, he's um, a Diddy sex slave. He's one of them. And he partook in events. He was in the same room with Rick Ross, Diddy, and DJ Khaled. Okay. He says they're all gay. Um, they partake in homosexual activities, the homosexual deviates, so and the hedonistic. It, you know, he he was there. He played in it. He he did guys. He did girls. He did all of that. So he's speaking on what he knows, not what he thinks. What he knows. All right. He also says they're part of Illuminati, the Boulets. I but the threat of death. let's segue into what I really want to talk about. Bujo Bantan. This is Bujo Bantan with his son Miles Myrie. Bujo Bantan, son of reggae dance hall icon Bujo Bantan, who's all right. Bujo Bantan has tragically passed. Come away. out of the news of his death was confirmed. American by his prison. Hazil Miri, marking a profound right. Come out of prison and their loved ones get deport back to Jamaica death are still unknown to don't have no working visa you can't get no visa no to go US got him dip your community but about 15 years what was it less than five years and get another visa the United States okay in less than five years and get another visa after coming out of a penitentiary convicted of a felony Welcome back to your second home. And when he does get to come back to the U.S., who coincidentally, his son died a week prior, and we all know how Illuminati do sacrifices. We all are aware that Illuminati do sacrifices. I'm not saying that would you sacrifice his blood yeah, son right. but uh, what i'm saying is that's right. it's kind of a coinky dink you know <laughs> all right Buffalo pushing it forward no so a couple of days prior him come to the u.s his son dies in florida in the same place where he was visiting but does he go visit his son grave does he go see the the, the mother I don't know maybe he did but he didn't put that in video documentary what he did put in video documentary was what first person he go look for is DJ Khaled first person he go looking for is DJ Khaled sitting on DJ Khaled's grass grassy knoll sitting on his couch a cock up foot and I take selfie But we're there. We, when I say we, I mean old school Jamaican. When we say we're not part of Batman, talk to Batman, mix and mingle with Batman. We know nothing with no Batman. And we stood firm on that. Right? And there are a lot of us that still stand on that. Big up, um. Foot the hype. Big up yourself, foot the hype. Street nation. Big up the street nation, them too. Right? But, yeah. But, you know, you grow up and you live, you learn. You don't put trust in no man. The Bible tell you don't put your trust in no man. 
You're not supposed to idolize no man. So this guy will come out, whether he's a musician or a politician, they will come out and step to the microphone because it's still public speaking. Trust me, I know. I took college classes on public speaking 101, public speaking 102. Those are one of the classes I took back in the 90s. All right, so I'm aware of it. Preachers, politicians, anyone that stepped to the pulpit, anyone that grabbed that microphone is public speaking. So, now, these people come out and tell you anything. They will tell you anything they want just so you could sway in their direction. All right, so, everybody of Abuja has a big Rasta man. He gets caught. Everybody's seen the video. He's taste testing it. You know what I mean? He got convicted. All right. Big time Rasta man, but in my cell cork. Okay. We forgive him. But no. There's another there's another angle at this. Yeah, big time Rasta man. And you are part with Batman. Side eye. Side eye. Big time Rasta man. No people can have you up as a, as a, as a drug dealer. I know people can have you up as a body man. And everybody with power with Kelly. Mavada, you're another one. Because you were signed to him. What did you have to do to get signed? What did you have to sacrifice? All of these individuals will have up DJ Khaled as as them brethren. Have up DJ Khaled as their homeboy. Have have up DJ Khaled as for them brother. You know them love use that word. That's my brother. Me don't want nobody to call me them brother. Cause me have no brother. Me have no sister. My mother have one child. Me. I don't want nobody to call me no brother. The only way somebody can call me brother is if we keep the same ideals and we keep the same beliefs. If we share the same ideals and we share the same beliefs, our next man can call me brother. But if we don't share the same ideals, I don't want nobody to call me no brother because there's only one pick that my mother have. But yeah, all these friends of DJ Khaled, or you can stand up next to that man. No, it's him just want to run up in your body. Or you can stand up next to that man. No, so that man that swallow man's seed. 